from Roy. We head north to West Palm Beach. Alex Finney is live with what she's learned about the company at the center of all this investigation. Alex. And so, Louie and Nicole, as we've heard and we've been reporting on, there are really definitely a lot of questions that still have to be answered here. Cast Construction LLC, they are at the center of all of this. We have called them, we have emailed them to try to get some sort of comment, but they have refused to get back to us. So we came to West Palm Beach, where their headquarters is at, in search for some answers. More questions coming out now following the deadly crane collapse Thursday in Fort Lauderdale. Officials have said the crane itself didn't fail. Instead, it was the platform holding equipment that fell onto the bridge below at Southeast Third Avenue. At the center of this construction nightmare is Cast Construction LLC. After our calls and emails for comment went unanswered, we paid a visit to the cast headquarters in West Palm Beach. They told they don't want anyone up here. No That's problem. what they told you. They don't want anybody up here. Did they, did they tell you no comment for us, the media? I can't answer no questions. Their office open, but they are staying tight-lipped, even when pressed. One person died as a result of that collapse, and you just want to know what happened. Cass said they do not want any comment. They have no comments. OSHA has opened up an investigation into Thursday's collapse. Upon further research, we've learned that this is now three OSHA inspections over the last year for cast construction. One in Sarasota in February of 2023, where employees were exposed to a 129 foot fall hazard. The fine was ultimately $9,844. And in June of that same year at a Tampa site, each employee was not protected from falling by the use of guardrails and employees were exposed to fall hazards of approximately eight feet. Cast was hit with a $15,625 fine. And a few years ago, back in 2016, a construction worker was killed on a job site in West Palm Beach. Cast Construction was the general contractor. OSHA stepped in and determined that the formwork table failed due to inadequate fastening design, among other things. A grievous error, as was put in the findings. And so we know that OSHA has since opened up this investigation. They're in, going to be looking into not only cast construction, but we also have Phoenix Rigging and Erecting LLC, as well as Maxim Crane Works. Now, it is worth noting that throughout our reporting today, I did reach out to everybody involved in all of this in terms of what OSHA is going to be looking into. I have not heard back from anyone. For now, that's the very latest live in West Palm Beach tonight. Alex Finney, Local 10 News.